Why do you care about making digital notes? Like, what are you actually trying to accomplish? That's not an easy thing to answer, but it's worth thinking about it. It's worth exploring. I can tell you what the answer is for me. For me, it's so I don't forget things, so I can make sense out of my experiences, so I can reference past thoughts as I write new thoughts so I can connect ideas across domains, and so I can develop those ideas across time, so I can create and share those ideas across the world, even if it's just the world between my two ears. Speaking from experience, it matters how you set up your digital library so that it can grow and evolve with you, not just this month, not just this year, but throughout your entire life. That's a really powerful thing. Because if you can't rely, if you can't trust your digital notes, you're one step away from digital dementia. A digital library should possess the ability to help you find what you're looking for, when you're looking for it, whether that's today or in 10 years from now. That's what it means to be future-proofed. Future-proofed notes are not fragile. They're not trapped in some proprietary software that may or may not be around five years from now. They are in a format that can be with you no matter what. That format is called plain text. And as long as there are computers, there will be computers that can read plain text. When you work in plain text files, that gives you the ability to keep your notes private. That means no company can sell your data, your private information to third parties it means that no company can lose your information to hackers who hack the companies that have your information. The beauty about plain text files is that you can keep them completely private, locally saved on your own computer. Your digital library should be a joy to use. You should enjoy spending time with it. It shouldn't be a place that causes anxiety because it's cluttered and chaotic. Instead, it can be a place of calm and serenity, a place where you have a sense of control, where you can develop ideas, where you can revisit past experiences and memories. This is the value of smartly linking your thinking, the ability to make meaningful notes across genre and throughout time. If this resonates with you, I encourage you to save this video as a handy reminder on why we're taking and making notes in the first place. Hey, and if you like this video, please subscribe below because there's a lot more to come on both the philosophical and the practical side of things. And I look forward to sharing it with you. Thank you.